Hey guys, this is the Fort Worth Glock guy, and I wanted to share with you these Night Eyes S Beaners. And I found these at REI. Um, I was over in Dallas recently, and there's an REI uh, in the area, and I had some time to kill, so I just walked around the store. And um, I love these little S Beaners, I use them all the time. Um, if you've followed my channel at all, um, you'll probably recognize this. Um, I usually carry like a flashlight and a little multi-tool on an S beaner and I just clip this S beaner inside my pocket and just it just dangles there so that way it's not bunched up in the bottom of my pocket um, and then following a few other channels um, you know there's always been the uh, complaint of the S beaner uh, coming unclipped like the gate is not strong enough to hold and things fall off for whatever reason. Um, I've never experienced that problem. Um, and you know, quite a few of you guys have come up with your own little solutions, um, especially on the larger ones where you put shrink tubing here or electrical tape or something along those lines um, to make it semi-permanent and um, that way the gates don't swing open accidentally. Um, but I thought this was kind of a cool little um, product that obviously Night Eyes is um, watching or you know listening to people complain about their issues that they've had and they've come up with what is called the micro lock and I, I'm not exactly sure how many what sizes these come in um, this is the only size that I saw um, at REI at the time which I believe this is a size one um, and uh, but what's really cool about this is, you know, if you do use these, you know, you can use the gate um, to clip whatever you want to on it. And you take this little piece of plastic and it just uh, clips around and there is a positive click. Like you can actually feel it and that way it keeps the gate closed. There's no way for it to um, come open. So anyways, this gate is uh, just a piece of plastic. Um, that rotates and you actually have to manually like undo it there's the back side of it if you're curious what it looks like and then again clip whatever you want to on it and then it gets to a point where it's touching both gates and then you twist it a little bit more and you can actually feel and hear a click and that way it's not going to accidentally come open. So I haven't actually put these on my keychain yet. Um, I just picked them up recently and I just haven't had a chance to use them. But I'm sure based on, you know, just the, the way that it's designed. I mean, unless this, unless you're really hard on your keys and this piece of plastic breaks off. Um, that might be a good solution for you guys. Um, I think I picked it, picked these up for five bucks um, for the pair, which isn't isn't too bad, I guess. Um, I would like to see the one size a little bit bigger, the size two, I believe. Um, and they may make those. I just didn't see any at the REI that I was at. Um, but I thought this was a kind of a cool little solution um, to some problems that people have been having with their um, S beaners. So anyways, um, just thought I'd share that with you. All right. Fort Worth Glock guy out.